enjoy the service in the presence of the Lord. Praise the Lord. Glorify the name of the Lord. So it's a great day again. Today is uh, April 25 and we have our Saturday service. And in the morning time, there are many saints that coming in the church pray. And after that, amen, they went out and go back in the employer house. But the service this afternoon is continually. And we will worship the Lord in spirit and in truth. Praise the Lord. Can we clap our hands for the glory of the Lord? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. this uh, amen service this afternoon in the Lord praise God we don't want to take this uh, service without the guidance and direction of the Lord Jesus Christ this afternoon so to all our brethren yes uh, feel at home amen if you are in, at home right now praise God yes uh, join with us in the service this afternoon Lord Jesus we come to you father in the name of Jesus Christ we dedicate the service to you, Father. Amen. In every line, every part of the service, Lord. Yes. Hallelujah. And we might glorify your name, Lord, especially, hallelujah, the preaching of your word. Yes. God, we ask your Jesus. abundant a blessing, your guidance, your direction, Lord. And especially, Lord, the anointing of your spirit, yes. oh God. Jesus. Hallelujah. Father, we dedicate the service to you. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Everybody say amen. 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 Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Amen. This is a great day. Let the Lord. Hallelujah. We'll be singing that song for all you've done. Praise the Lord. Blessed be the name of the Lord. Blessed be the name of the Lord. 
Amen. As we continue worshiping the Lord. Praise God. If you know the song, blessed be the Lord God Almighty. Amen. Hallelujah. And we need to open our heart, our minds. Amen. Direct to the throne of the Lord. As we sing the song with all our heart. Amen. Hallelujah. Father in heaven, how we love you. come together in prayer God that we pray your divine protection Lord in this world especially those people who are infected Lord every day oh God we pray God that give deliverance to these people oh God there will be healing upon their body oh God do not let them Lord die Lord hallelujah but give them the chance Father to live yes, more, oh God. Yes. To know you more, God. Yes, to be baptized in your name, oh God. Yes, Repent yes. from their sin, yes, Lord. Jesus. That they might recognize you that you are yes. the Savior of the world. Yes, you are the healer, oh God, of all sickness or illness, Lord. We pray continually, Lord. 
your divine provision, Lord, to every city, to every province, and every barangay, Lord, every nation's Lord, hallelujah, that they are devastated, Lord, by this virus. Father, we pray, God, hallelujah, that you can end up this kind of pandemic, Lord. Yes, Lord. It will go into diminish. It going to disappear, O oh God, by the power of your name, O oh God. And restore the economy of this world, God. In the name of Jesus Christ, Lord. We thank you so much, Father. And today, Lord, hallelujah, we will worship you, Lord, upon hearing the preaching of your word. Hallelujah. And I pray that prepare all the hearts of our viewers today, yes. oh God. Hallelujah. Yes, all over the world that reaching this video is streaming, Lord God. Hallelujah. That they might be, hallelujah, reach out to the power of your spirit yes. and the power of your word. Thank you, Father. We ask all these things in the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Everybody say in Jesus' name. Jesus. Can we clap our hands for the glory of the Lord one more time? Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Amen, hallelujah. So today I know that our heart is already tuned in in the spirit of the Lord as we are worship. And every heart I believe that ready now to receive the engrafted word of the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. And we have our wonderful great brother here. Amen. And Hallelujah. changed by the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. From, from darkness into his marvelous Glory. light. Amen. Praise Jesus. the Lord. Hallelujah. And I know you have been seeing him. Amen. In, uh, in the Facebook. Amen. He has also preaching. But this day is a great day for him. That he will use by the Lord. Amen. Through the power of his anointing. Praise God. So, may I ask now, Brother Joel Buhia. Praise God. Please come, brother. Yes, brother. And Hallelujah. preach the word of the Lord in Lord. season. We are out of season. Yes, Praise Lord. Lord. Let's clap our hands to the Lord. Praise God. Hallelujah. Glory to thy name. Glory to the name, Lord. It's so wonderful to uh, have you. And thank you for watching. Thank you for tuning in. For those of you who are watching right now, live broadcast. We are here at uh, New Life Fellowship Church in Shekong Choi, and I, 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 wherever you are, all over the world, God bless you and thank you for tuning in. And um, today, uh, I will be preaching the Word of God, and uh, before that, I would like to enlighten you that there's a good news. The good news is that, church, that there's freedom in Jesus Christ. Amen. All your sorrows, Amen. all your worries, pain, vices, Temptations that you committed, your the fornications and lies, all of that, that transgression will be washed away by the blood of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. In Jesus' name, amen. amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Uh, let us now come in the presence of the Lord. And uh, as you may know, I, I'm hoping that you have your sword with you, the Bible that you have. And I would like you to open it up in the book of Exodus 20, chapter 20, verse 3. To six. Once again, Exodus 20, verses 3 to 6. It says here, Thou shalt have no other gods before me. Thou shalt not have unto thee any graven images of any likeness of any things that is in heaven above, or that is earth beneath, mm -hmm. or that is in the water under the earth. Amen. 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 Thou shalt not bow down thyself to them, nor serve them. Hallelujah. For the Lord thy God am I jealous. God. Visiting the iniquity of the fathers upon the children, unto the third and the fourth generation of them that hate me. And showing mercy in thousands of them that love me and keep my commandments. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Jesus. We have read the word of the Lord, and I would like to ask Pastor Ababili Brad to, to give us a short prayer in our service today. Praise God. Again, Lord, we are standing in your presence, asking your favor, your grace, and blessing, Lord, upon our brother that you will use right now. 
to preach, to teach, Lord, your word. Lord, use him through the power of your spirit. Yes, Lord. And I yes. pray, Father, the double portion of your anointing yes. that could envelop his life, his lips right now. Yes, Lord. Speak to us, Lord, through him, God. Yes. Hallelujah. Oh, and reach out people, those who are afar off, oh God, through this message, Lord. Hallelujah. Yes. They will deliver. They will be encouraged, Lord, and they will be lifted up, oh God. I pray, Father God, that there will be salvation, Lord, upon this world. Yes. Through the preaching of this, your yes. word, God. Yes. There will be healing, God. Yes. Spiritual yes. and physical healing, God. Yes. Father, we claim today, Lord, the power of your name yes. and the power of your spirit, Lord. Yes. That is able to move to every individual heart. Yes. Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Let me begin by asking everyone a question. Do you still have idols and graven images in your house? Or do you still worship in front of these man-made images? This isn't a service or a preaching that will somehow assault, insult, or confront someone's belief. This Amen. isn't it. Amen. Amen. As a mere fact of what the Lord is trying to tell you today in this service is just to enlighten you. All right. To give you a little bit more understanding that there is freedom yes. in Jesus Christ. Amen. Amen. Now is the time to break the chain, church. People Amen. who are listening to this live broadcast. Yes. Now is the time to break the chain. All right. All of this old age tradition is because... We don't have you don't have the proper way of worshiping and right. praising the Lord Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. Some may say it's just a customary. It's a way that you people grow up with, mm -hmm. and the way that you just visualize God in a sense of having a an altar or having a graven images of Christ. Right. Uh -huh. But it is not. I'm telling you now, stop. Mm -hmm. Stop this tradition that you inherit from your ancestors. Put it away or destroy them, if you will. Put it away because it is not the proper way to worship Amen. the true Amen. living Amen. God. Hallelujah. That's right. That's right. Yeah. You are probably asking, why should you do that? Because in John 4.24... It says, God is spirit. Amen. 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 And they that worship him must worship him in spirit and in, and truth. in truth. Hallelujah. Amen. And the biggest question is, hallelujah, what is the biggest flaw in mankind? All right. Hallelujah. To define what flaw is, this is the blemish, the imperfection, uh -huh. the weakness or the limitation of one person. Your shortcoming or your lacking of. Okay. Uh -huh. That is a flaw. And what is the flaw of mankind? Is it our sin? No. no. Is it adultery? No. Mm -hmm. Is it our drinking, smoking, and gambling habits? No, it's not. Is it idolatry? Uh -huh. No. But the biggest flaw in mankind is pride. Pride. Because of pride, exactly. Amen. There is a fruit of disobedience. Yes. Uh -huh. Our pride is the main source of the problem. And this is the biggest flaw of mankind. Yes. And who is the source of this pride and this disobedience? Satan himself. Yes. Yes. Hallelujah. He is putting the seed of pride and disobedience in our hearts. Uh -huh. And because of that, the reason why he's putting it into our hearts is because he wanted to be God himself. And it's not even possible. It is not possible. It says, if you can remember the story of, of Lucifer in Ezekiel 28, chapter 28, verses 14 to 19. It says here, Thou art the anointed hero that covereth, and I have set thee so, that was upon the holy mountain of God, 
that has walked up and down in the midst of stone of fire. Yeah. And chapter 15, thou was perfect in thy ways for the days that thou was created till iniquity was found in thee. All right. Hallelujah. In, chapter, in verse 16, by the multitude of thy merchandise, I have filled thy midst of thee with violence, and thou hast sinned. Therefore I will cast thee as profane out of the mountain of God, and I will destroy thee, O covering hero, from the midst of the stone of fire. Yeah. Hallelujah. Thine heart was lifted up because of thine beauty. Mm -hmm. This is one of the gods of it. Mm -hmm. Because of his own beauty, he self-believed that he yeah. can be God. But once again, he cannot be because there is always, always be one God. Man. Amen. 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 And his heart, it says here, thou hast corrupted thy wisdom by reason mm -hmm. of thy brightness. Yeah. I will cast thee to the ground. I will lay thee before the king that they may behold thee. Hallelujah. Oh, yeah. And in verse 18, thou hast defiled thy sanctuaries by multitudes of thine iniquities. All right. By the iniquity of thy traffic. Therefore, will bring forth fire from the midst of thee. It shall devour thee, and I will bring thee to ashes upon the earth in the sight of all them that behold thee. And in the last verse, all they that know thee among the people shall be as astonished at thee. Thou shalt be a traitor terror. and a terror, and never shalt thou be any more. Hallelujah. Because of pride and disobedience. Yes. Uh -huh. Of course, in people, we commit sin. And that's because of Satan. And that's because this is what he wanted. He wanted us to be in power, to be in control of our own lives. Uh -huh. All right. But we are not. We are bound to serve the Lord. We are Amen. bound to serve Amen. the true King Amen. and the Lord Amen. to Lord. Hallelujah. Because of this pride, this happened, and we have this disobedience. In our hearts. Mm -hmm. That's why we commit sins. This goes to the people who worship idols. All people right. commit sins because you worship idols. Uh -huh. And once again, I told you, trust me, this worshiping type is a sin. Because all people who does this commit sin. Not just that. All people have sinned. And it says in Romans 3.23, For all have sinned and come short in the glory of God. Because of pride, we disobey uh -huh. all right. and we commit sin. Right. If you say you believe in God and you devote your whole life in God, uh -huh. why do you still have the graven images in your house, come on, around on. your neck, in. and in your wrist? Yes, you have to get rid of that Hallelujah. starting today. And start realizing that there is a true living God that you have to worship. Yes. Starting today. And this Amen. is the reason why it's happening around the world right now. Hallelujah. 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 If you really believe in Jesus, you should get rid of all these things. Yes. Uh -huh. And you will be free. You will be Amen. set free. And you will have freedom in Jesus Christ. All right. Hallelujah. Because of our superstition, that's another thing. This... Superstition is another reason why we believe in these things. I'm telling you, superstition will not save your soul. Amen. Amen. Only Jesus can. That's right. Hallelujah. Blessed be the name, Blessed of, the be the name of the Lord. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I know that some of us have been renewed in many types of religions that, where we came from. But my family, I'm telling you, my family was born and raised as a Pentecost. And we have no experience of having any idols or sort of images in our house. But I have some friends. I have lots of friends Praise God. who worship idols in their house. And they attend the church that has really, really big structures. Has really, really big uh, idols and images and graven images of Christ. Mm -hmm. Even my wife. She used to go to churches like that. And she even had a rosary. And I remember her reciting her prayers through every beads of the rosary 
and, and, and she even had her own small statues of Jesus and the statues of Mary and, 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 and baby Jesus and all. She even had a picture in her wallets and in her books. But praise God, yes. she doesn't have them anymore. Amen. Hallelujah. Whoa. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Her eyes are open in a ways of worshiping the true and living God. She now knows and she has the knowledge and wisdom from God that she even completed her discipleship classes Hallelujah. here Amen. in the United Pentecostal Church. Praise Hallelujah. God. Praise God. Her knowledge about God has increased. She worships God in spirit and in truth. Amen. She prays fervently in her heart and not in memorized text anymore. Uh -huh. Hallelujah. She turned her back against idols and now... She's serving the one and only true living God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. She is free from bondage and sin through idol worship. And so you, you will be free once that you open your eyes and listen to these words of God right now. When you accept Jesus in your life, He will create a clean heart in you and God will renew a right spirit within you. Hallelujah. He will restore you he will give you salvation and set your spirit free. And you will be sitting at the right hand of the Father in the eternal life. Hallelujah. 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 It says in Revelation 21, 4, God shall wipe away all your tears. And there shall be no more death, neither sorrow, nor crying. Mm -hmm. Neither shall there be no more pain. For the Amen. former things Amen. are passed away. away. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. So when we come near to God, we must believe in Him completely. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. We must want Him and only to obey Him and follow His will. Hallelujah. Amen. He has made us clean deep inside in ourselves so that oh, we may be set God. free. Oh, God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. We are free to stop thinking about worrying things about things that of this world. Hallelujah. We will be really cleansed. It is like He has washed our body with clean water. Amen. Hallelujah. Do not let yourself be like the people who belong to this world, but instead let God change how you think. Praise God. Amen. Then you will become a new person. Yeah. You will be able to understand what God wants you to do. And the will of God will make you understand, and God will make you happy. Hallelujah. 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 How to obtain complete salvation, happiness, eternal life. Yeah. Our first step is following Acts 2.23. It says here, that Peter said unto them, Repent and be baptized, every one of you. In the name of Jesus Christ. There is no other name Amen. but Jesus Christ. Yes. Right. Hallelujah. For the remissions of what? Sins. Your sins. sins. All your sins will be washed away. And he shall give you the gift of the Holy Ghost, which be will be your guiding light upon the earth. Hallelujah. through water baptism and through receiving the gift of the Holy Ghost you will be set free all of these graven images should fall down right now from your houses yes and it should be removed around your neck and around your wrist uh -huh. and wherever you may put it you should set it aside you should yes. put it away you should burn it you should throw it away Hallelujah. Amen. So I'm about to end. We can't even fathom the journey of our life. We have but known that God has place and a plan for each and every one of us. In this world, right now and beyond, God has immense and greater purpose that none of us can understand. But from today, okay, I was born and 45 years from now, I still feel the presence of the Lord. His guidance, His leading, 
And whatever little things that he does in my life, I can feel it. So today, you will feel the same way Amen. if you submit yourself yes. to God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. His mercy endured forever, and His love is eternal. His forgiveness is for everyone. And salvation in His name is real. Amen. Believe me, church. Amen. Hallelujah. Amen. We can go about understanding and pride against the will of God, but that's because Jesus allowed this unwise decision to happen. The reason why you can do all things that you're doing is because God is allowing it and God is letting you do it. But I'm telling you, church, time will come and that time is very short. You see the things that's happening around you, that's happening around us. It is the wake up call of God. Amen. It is the wake up call to return to God and worship the true and living God. Hallelujah. I'm telling you, church, one day you will understand that His plan in your life is perfect plan. All right. And one day you will say to yourself, just like what I said to myself, oh, well. I should have done it a long time ago. Okay. I should have listened to God's calling when I was young. Trust me, if you have done it from the very start, you will never have a great testimony to yes. tell about the goodness of the Lord yes. in your life. Hallelujah. Amen. Amen. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Glory, glory. A testimony about how God temporal, temporarily, or how this world gives you temporary happiness, but God will give you complete happiness. Uh -huh. Hallelujah. Your transgressions will be washed away, and great things will happen to you because God will use you in His ministry. Yes. Hallelujah. 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 He is faithful, and He loves each and every one of you. Amen. Each and every one of us. Hallelujah. In 1 John chapter 4, verse 10, it says here, Herein is love. Not that we love God, but that He loved us and sent His Son to be the propitiation of our sins. Nothing's more rewarding. Nothing's more fruitful. All right. Nothing's more real than submitting yourself to the Lord and to the King that created you. Amen. Hallelujah. I can go on and on about what God has done for me. And I can go on and on about the goodness of God. And Amen. All. Amen. Hallelujah. But at this point, I want you to experience it yourself. Hallelujah. This experience is a feeling that you have that you should accept Christ in your, in your life once again. Amen. Amen. I will let you decide. I want you to see it for yourself. Feel it for yourself by simply obeying Acts 2.38. Amen. Yes. And your journey in your life will begin. Amen. That is the good news of the Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Oh, hallelujah. hallelujah. Now I just want to remind you, hallelujah, that in 1 John chapter 5, verse 20 to 21, it says here, And we know that the Son of God is come, mm -hmm. and hath given us an understanding that we may know him that is true, that we are in him that is true, even in his Son, Jesus Christ. This is the true God. And eternal life. Amen. Praise Hallelujah. Praise Little Praise children, Praise keep yourselves from idols. Amen. Right. Amen. Now, Amen. I challenge you. Time to begin your new journey in life. Amen. With a right way of worship, with a right way of praise, and Amen. with a right way, and with your faith, while you're going in this journey, you will have full freedom Amen. in Jesus Christ. Amen. Hallelujah. Now we give back this Praise service to Bobby Brown. Praise God. What a message. Yes. Before we close the service this afternoon, Amen. We have heard a wonderful message from our brother. Amen. That the reason amen. why that the Lord gave us a freedom, Amen. Praise God. Because this preaching of the Word of God, the Lord wants us to help. To release from the clutches 
of sin and bondage of this world. Amen. Amen. And the only one thing that God is going to release us, amen, come out from the box of our pride. Amen. Amen. Stop listening to those, amen, evil things that whispering in our life. There is only one message that the Lord wants us to release from the clutches, amen, of sin and pleasures in this world. Yeah. We need to come into repentance. Amen. Amen. Religion yeah. cannot save us. Yes. Even our ritual ceremony cannot yes. save us. Hallelujah. The things that cannot, people cannot come to God because of pride. Uh -huh. But God wants us to come out inside that nest of pride. And the only thing that we need to be today to to come to the Lord and repent and asking God forgiveness in our right. Amen. Amen. Repentance Amen. is the best state if you want Amen. to come to the Lord with your faith to the Lord. Amen. If you believe God, Amen, you need to come into repentance. And after that, here is it. You need to get baptized in the name of Jesus Amen. Christ. Amen. Yes. And the purpose Amen. is for the forgiveness of our sin. Amen. Amen. No one can can forgive our sin except the Lord Jesus Christ. Yes. Yes. If we get baptized in that name, buried in water in the name of Jesus Christ, Hallelujah. all our sins from being child unto this day, all of our sin is going to be forgiven. Amen. So that's the challenge this afternoon. Hallelujah. 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 So this afternoon, if you are not you've been decided. Today is the day of our salvation. Yes. If you have not been baptized in the name of Jesus Christ, yes. today is the day of our salvation. We know that the, the enemy comes from heaven when he, God kicked him out in heaven. Yes. Amen. He fall down on earth to bring confusion, to bring pride to the people. That's what the Bible said in John chapter 10 verse 10. The thief cometh not. But to steal and to kill and to destroy. But Jesus said, I am come Amen. that he might have life yes. and he might have Amen. it more Hallelujah. abundantly. Hallelujah. Praise God. Only Jesus is the answer of everything. Yes. Only Jesus yes. is the answer of the chaos that yes. happened.
salvation. There Jesus. will be a healing. Yes. There will Jesus. be deliverance, Lord. To yes. those people who are now watching, Jesus. Lord. Jesus. And pray, Lord, with us today. Jesus. I pray touch their physical body. Yes. Give them healing, O oh God. Yes. Hallelujah, Jesus. Hallelujah. And encourage them, Lord, from their discouragement situation. Or discouraged situation, Lord. Yes. We pray, thank you, Jesus. As we end up this service, Lord, we claim, Lord, the power of your name. Yes, Lord. Hallelujah. The power of your spirit that continue to reach out people around the world. In the name of Jesus Christ, we bring back all the glory, thanksgiving, and honor. Everybody say, in Jesus' name. In Jesus name. Hallelujah. Clap your hands for the glory of the Lord. Thank you so much for the coming Saturday again. If the the quarantine enhancement are not yet finished, and we believe, Amen, this quarantine is going to be over. Amen. amen. Coming soon. Yes. Praise God. We believe it. Amen. And thank you so much. Praise God. And Pastor Plaza is the one who operate our uh, video today. Amen. Praise God. Hallelujah. And there are some Saturday brethren, a few, few only. Praise God. Amen. That they are with us this afternoon. Amen. So thank you so much for uh, watching this video. God bless you. And we declare the power of the name of Jesus Christ that continue to envelop us wherever we go. Amen. To God be the glory. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Thank you so much. And good afternoon to all of us. In Jesus' name.